Your power tool uses a variable speed switch. The switch turns the tool on and off and allows you to vary the speed. Over time, the switch can fail. It may no longer turn the tool on, might work intermittently, or might only run at one speed. Replacing the switch is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless drills, kitchen mixers, outdoor drills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the handle cover. Now note the location of each of the wires and remove them from the old switch. To remove the red wire, I press a small screwdriver in the small rectangular opening next to it. The yellow wire removes with the screwdriver in the opening on the side of the switch. Now I can install the new switch. First, the red wire. The red wire just pushes into the opening on the bottom of the switch. Next, the yellow. And same thing, it just pushes into the opening. Then the white wire goes into the round opening and gets secured with the screw. And last, the black wire. And now reinstall the handle cover. And now you know how to install a new switch in your power tool. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.